Hey traders, um, Andy here. So I thought I'd just drop you a quick video. Um, I got asked this uh, question the other day and I thought it would be worth sharing my thoughts on it. And the question was, you know, if you were just kind of starting out now as a trader, as a new trader or getting into it, you know, what advice would you give somebody? You know, what's the number one tip that you could give somebody getting into it? So, you know, you've never done anything to do with financial markets. You've never traded um, stocks or, or FX or cryptos. And you're looking at getting into it because you want to make a little bit of extra money alongside your job. Um, or maybe you want to quit your job and, and, and have a different way of earning money. Okay, whatever your reasons are. And you're looking at trading. You know, what is the number one thing that um, I would give as advice? That was the question. And it's a great question because there's so much advice that I can give you. You know, I've done, I've been trading the financial markets now for the best part of 18 years. And during that period, I've had um, some real bad times and some great times. And it's part of, part of the, the, the interesting thing about the financial markets, it's the journey that you personally go on as well, overcoming challenges. And, you know, I've learned a lot about trading and myself and I've grown a lot over those years. And so, you know, of course, when you get into this kind of um, space, you know, the, the main objective is to make money. And often that's where the focus goes. So you, you kind of start thinking about, you know, how much money you're going to make or how much money you personally need to make. And maybe there's a couple of things that you need to think about before we think about money, you know, because money goes to those that have a certain skill that can deliver a certain value to the world. Um, and, you know, if you're just getting started in in trading, you know, you, you kind of don't want to have those expectations that you're just going to immediately be able to, you know, replace your job, start making money, and, you know, without having to put any, you know, any any effort in to learn how the financial markets work. The reality is very different. Now, I'm not saying it needs to take years for you to be successful. In fact, quite the opposite. You can succeed quite quickly, as I've seen many, many others do um, as complete beginners. However, there is a process to it. There is a process to you know, achieving success in the financial markets. And, you know, my tip um, is actually, if I had to only give you one tip, it would be to start off with um, actually focusing on enjoying the process, okay? Enjoy the process more than, you know, doing it just for the money, just to, just to make some money. Once you start to enjoy the process, the money will come, the results will come because you're now no longer, you know, thinking about money, but you're thinking about, you know, the, the doing the right things that will eventually bring you that money. So learning how the markets work, building some rules, building structure, um, understanding your personality um, and how it applies to trading, understanding your mindset. And if you can do that, you're going to be, you know, firstly, your expectations are going to be met, and they're going to, and you're, and and more than that, you're probably going to achieve a lot more than you've even realised that you can achieve, because, quite frankly, you know, success at trading is a formula. It's nothing that somebody couldn't achieve, no matter what your background is. You don't need to be in the financial market. You don't need to have a finance background to succeed at trading. You just need to understand the process. You need to have the right structure, processes, rules, right mindset, um, and and keep your expectations, um, keep your expectations low and focus on the process and your results are going to astound you. So I just wanted to shoot you that, um, that piece of advice that I gave somebody um, just the other day, because it's a great question. And you know, because you can do anything for money, you can go and sell on eBay, why trading? You know, you've got to enjoy what you do, okay? I couldn't think of anything worse than selling stuff on eBay and having to go to the post office and sending them off. Whereas, I, you know, bring up a chart and I could spend hours and hours and hours spending my time looking at it and observing it and drawing my lines. 
I love it, absolutely love it. So I enjoy the process. And then obviously with that knowledge, I can then make money from it as well. Um, and by the way, just in case you don't know, I am going to be doing a live masterclass uh, Wednesday, 8 p 8.30 p.m. UK time. Um, so if you're interested in joining that, it's going to be an FX, particularly an FX masterclass where I'll be teaching you some of these core principles. I will leave a link for you to, go, for you to join underneath this uh, video. So if you're getting an email, then it'll be in the email. If you're, getting, if you're watching this in one of our social media platforms, there'll be a link below. You can just register for that FX Masterclass and join me live and um, so you can learn a little bit more about what it takes to, um, to become a financial trader. Hope you have a great day. Good trading to you all and take care. Bye-bye.